I never thought I was going to be a Master Gunner Sergeant in the United States Marine Corps. And to be the first from Palau and to be the first from this place, it means a lot. Not so much for me, but there's somebody that's sitting in my uh, shoes somewhere else here in Palau that needs to see that, hey, you can come from this to Master Gunner Sergeant E9 in the Marine Corps. My name is Master Gunner Sergeant Milton Donatus. I'm from Marar, Palau. We're actually at my hometown, Ngaklao, Marar, in the Republic of Palau. We got a fist man. We see he had a spear. But he normally just go out here and collect fish. I love the U.S. I love the U.S. to the point where my people look at me like, bro, you know you're Palau, right? I know I am Palau by birth. Our grandmother used to gather us around and tell us stories. And the stories that she always told us was how the Japanese used to uh, occupy the whole uh, Republic of Palau and how they were uh, planning on um, making this a Japanese uh, nation. So uh, she told us about that and how the Marines came up and liberated the island. That's all she was talking about was the Marines. And that's the reason why I joined the Marine Corps. So I waited until I graduated high school, moved to Guam. Uh, in 95, in hopes of joining the, the Marine Corps, but come to find out that uh, the office, the recruiting office closed in 93, back in the drawdown of the military. So I was there until 2000 when they reopened, and then that's when I joined the Marine Corps. And I actually asked the recruiter if he can sign me up for 20 years. Right there and then, I didn't know any better, but here I am 24 years later, and I wanted to be infantry. Again, I didn't know much about the Marine Corps. I just knew about people fighting and liberating our people. So I asked for the job that gets me into the fight. I swore in, they did the paperwork, and then I left. It was a culture shock. And then they spoke different language too at uh, recruit training. What the chief said this morning, Chief Reclai said, he went over there the same way. And the best advice that he got was monkey see monkey do. You just look at what's going on around you and do it faster than everyone around you. Also, High Chief Reclai's got all kinds of information and he's updated and he's well in tune with the, the military. The closest recruiting is Guam. They have the 1-800 number. You can always reach them on, uh, online, but it's not as hard as before. I think as a Marine Corps to the, the public, I would say the Marines are here to help you. Be there to also help them because they're here to make sure that we are safe. They work on the infrastructure for the uh, people. They have the best intention and they are the right people to mentor our youth for the future of Palau. And that's what Koamoana is.